Apple is planning to announce a 15-inch MacBook Air at its WWDC conference on June 5. The 15-inch MacBook Air will be powered by the standard M2 chip and there will be multiple GPU configurations. There are no rumored design changes to the laptop except for the larger display size. Apple will also announce iOS 17, macOS 14, watchOS 10, tvOS 17, and an AR, VR headset at the event. Jeffrey Hinton, one of the godfathers of AI, has quit his job at Google to speak freely about the risks of AI. He says that a part of him regrets his life's work. Hinton's work directly led to the development of technologies like ChatGPT and Google Bard. He claims that competition with new AI technologies will be impossible to stop and result in a world with so much misinformation that people won't be able to tell what is true anymore. The technology could also eliminate jobs, and possibly humanity itself, as it starts learning to write and run its own code. Semantic decoders are AI systems that can translate people's brain activity into streams of text. They can be used to benefit patients who have lost their ability to physically communicate. Researchers at the University of Texas have developed a semantic decoder system using a transformer model. It doesn't require any surgical implants and it can produce text that closely or precisely matches the intended meaning of words around half the time. The decoder still can't be used outside of a lab setting as it requires an fMRI scanner, but the researchers believe that they could eventually make a more portable system. A collaboration of researchers through the Wallenberg Wood Science Center have created the world's first wooden transistor. It is 3 centimeters across and switches at less than 1 hertz. The transistor works by electrochemically modulating conductivity within conducting channels inside the wood's pores with the help of a penetrating electrolyte. It could be used for specialized applications, including biodegradable computing and implanting into living plant material. Teletrace is a distributed tracing system that helps developers monitor and troubleshoot complex distributed systems. It can be easily deployed and scaled. Teletrace supports multiple storage options. This hacker news thread contains examples of projects that developers built for themselves. There are many pages of interesting comments. The top comment links to the other pages for easy access. Examples include a dementia support system for a family, automated systems to take pictures of trains as they pass, and an automated hydroponic grow tent. AI can be used to deliver human intentions to traditional algorithmic APIs. The rewrite is part of a wider effort to replace older critical infrastructure pieces with memory-safe counterparts. Vercel has added a new suite of serverless storage options and new security and editing features. The FDIC has accepted JP Morgan's bid for First Republic. EVA is an AI relational database system for building simpler and faster AI-powered applications. It can operate on both structured and unstructured data using deep learning models. EVA accelerates AI pipelines by 10 to 100x. It comes with a wide range of models for analyzing unstructured data. Bhutan has been using electricity from its hydroelectric plants to mine Bitcoin since it was worth $5,000. Rapid security response is a feature that enables quicker and more frequent security patches for Apple's newest operating systems.